Good morning, you two. Good morning. Coming at you from the Bear household. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that first video back. If you haven't yet watched it, please do go like it and let us know what you think. Uh, today's main topic is gonna be a full day of eating of both the wife and I. So we're both in our improvement season eating a lot of food. So we thought it'd be a good idea to take you along for the day so you can kind of see what we're eating, the amounts as far as calories and macronutrients go. I'm getting ready to start prep probably in about two weeks. So I figured why not show you guys uh, what a full day eating a uh, fuck ton of calories is like with me. Sometimes I don't know how he eats that much food because Forever hungry. Forever I'm happy hungry. with my macros right now. We're about like 270 and we'll, we'll put all the macros and everything on the screen, but yeah. I'm about 275 carb right now, which is probably the most that I've ever eaten, but he's like triple that. I don't know. <laughs> Two boxes of cereal a day, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, I'm not that high, but uh, yeah, we'll give you the macro counts of everything below so you guys can see all those fun details and yeah, hopefully you guys get some ideas and see what, uh, what kind of food you can incorporate in your daily life. So. Have some fun. All right, so I'm having my first meal of the day. It's about 10.30 right now. Um, I used to be the type of person to get up really early, eat my first meal at like 5 a.m., but that was when my macros were freaking low and I was starving all the time. So since I've been eating a little bit, I typically will just kind of work for a couple hours in the morning and then I'll make my breakfast um, a little closer before we head out for the gym. So what we're working with here, I keep this meal usually the same every single morning. We're gonna be making a bagel sandwich. So these are the best, the Dave Killers bread, everything bagels. We're gonna do a little egg white omelet, some egg whites on the sandwich. And then typically I'll do like turkey bacon, but I ran out last night, so we're doing turkey breast. <laughs> and then I am a sweet and savory girl. You're gonna see me put in some honey on my breakfast sandwich. If you haven't done this yet, highly recommend. <laughs> All right, so breakfast sandwich and egg omelet down. And then the macros for this meal are right here. So we're gonna do, or I did 138 grams of egg whites or egg substitute. I think they taste a little bit better. Um, I have a slice of Vel Velveeta cheese and I just kind of distributed that on both of them. And then, like I said, I usually do turkey bacon, but we did half a serving of turkey and then about four grams of honey on the bagel. That's so good. <laughs> Just got a brand new 40 ounce shaker. I like the 40 ounce shakers for my intro workout shake, so you're gonna see what we're gonna put in there here in a second. A little bit of ice. 40 ounces of water. All right, here we got five grams of creatine mono from Morphe Nutrition, code BA. Link is down below. Then I'll put one scoop of essential amino acids, which is about 20 grams, peach rings, fire. And then key ingredient is gonna be what's called hexagen. This is my intra-workout carbohydrates. So I'll put about one serving of this, which is gonna be about 25 grams of carbohydrates in the form of cyclic dextrin. Very quickly digested, utilizing the muscle, carries over to performance and gains. Here we got three English muffins. I normally do two English muffins and a bagel, but the wifey snatched the last bagel. So it's okay. We're gonna do three bagels, or three English muffins, two toasting at a time. Go get some eggs at the same time. So these are the cinnamon protein English muffins. If you guys have not had these, highly recommend.
All right. And there we have it. I usually stand when I eat. Yeah. Um, in my hand, we have a bunch of multivitamins. Um, I'll go over the explanation in an actual video in detail of exactly what it is I'm taking, but just know I take a lot of pills in the morning. Uh, we have about 30 grams of protein in eggs, uh, a little bit of ketchup, salt, and then, like I said, I have three English muffins. Uh, they're the protein cinnamon English muffins. They're of like nine protein, 23 carb, one fat per English muffin. Usually do English muffins with some bagels, but instead we had to improvise with three English muffins since Babe took the last uh, uh, bagel. Uh, drizzled honey, salt on that, glass of orange juice, Typically going for about 100 to 125 carbs pre-workout. Um, we'll flash the exact macros somewhere around here. And yeah, after this, we're gonna, about to, we're gonna go train and hit some legs. So see you in the next clip. I can't tell. Don't touch it! Oh, it's alive. Dilly's gonna sting you. Stop, stop. Just another day in the desert. Fuck yeah. that. Fuck that. Yeah. All right, so we are on our way to the gym, and look, more carbs, because Wizards. your boy eating good. So typically on the way to the uh, gym, I'll have about another 25 carbs in the form of banana, apple, rice cakes, or candy. Today, it's candy. What? Also, Team Twizzler, stand up. And I'm curious too, do you like your chewy candy like super soft and mushy, or do you like it when it's like a little hard? She likes that hard shit. <laughs> you don't? I do typically, but when it comes to Twizzlers, this shit's fucking real hard. I like it a little softer. Hard gummies but are like way Jay better. But like Jay said, team pull apart Twizzler. If I had those, I'd be eating those too. Yeah. Team hard candy. Do they have sour Twizzlers? Uh, if not, know. they should. Make them. So we go for that. Do they? Oh. Do they have sour Twizzlers? So we had to make a stop to the store. <laughs> Let's go look. <laughs> All right, welcome back to Muscle Factory. Leg day today. Again, for me. That's what I was doing the last time too. You're a deadlift though. Leg. You ready oh, for deads? Dylan's making me do to some deadlifts today. Grow that booty. I mean, look at this thing. Oh, <laughs> let's go. Going in your hair with your hand gives me feelings I don't understand. You do this thing when you're biting your lip. It's driving me crazy just looking at it. You know me better than I know myself. I don't wanna live in a world without you. All right, just had a killer leg day. Top it off, 50, ga oh, 50, 50 grams of protons. Can't fucking talk. Still losing my voice from a couple weeks ago, but we're good. Hit some badass deads. My legs are feeling it. Lauren's at the vape shop. Vape shop, she's got a fucking problem. <laughs> Meal I tell you? I was a kid, she went to the vape stop. Meal number two, energy drink and vapes. <laughs> Just kidding. Kind it's of. balance. Exactly, like my tattoo, balance. <laughs> but midday, pick me up. Watermelon Monster. Sponsor us. And then what flavor? Please sponsor us. Banana ice cream or spearmint? Ooh. I'm stocking up. We're going Banana. to a, mu a music festival to Banana. this week. Okay. Banana. She's the only girl that has caffeine immediately after her workout. I don't. Caffeine free. Do you not feel drained? I feel drained after my workout. I feel like it's a good pick me up. It's almost two. <laughs> Judge me. Post workout meal, we got two packs of oatmeal, threw in some eggs in there, a uh, scoop of vegan protein powder, topping it with blueberries, and my fave, 
honey nut checks. I usually go with cream of rice, but we're out of cream of rice. So two bags of oatmeal it is today. How cute. <laughs> we're both oatmeal buddies today. So I do this every post-workout. So Dylan copied me. But <laughs> we got one packet of low, uh, low sugar oatmeal. I love thick oats. So who else out there is team thick oats? Yes. <laughs> so I add a scoop of vegan protein powder um, and a cup of the light and fit yogurt. Mix it together. Bloobs, peanut butter. Yum. Yes. <laughs> and since we have a lot of carbs to eat, I'm throwing in two white cheddar rice cakes to top it off. Mm. Boy, though. <laughs> Look at that. How much are you adding? As much as I want. Oh, actual. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I suck at keeping up with appointments, but <laughs> when I was prepping uh, this past year, one thing that I started incorporating a lot into my routine was going to a stretch lab. So if you've never heard of that, basically you go in, you're paired up with a stretchologist, and they stretch you for 55 minutes. Um, I'm probably the worst at remembering to stretch before or after a workout, but once I started going to stretch lab and I was doing it once or twice a week during prep just to help with my recovery, um, I realized how important it actually is. So I decided to make another appointment. I probably have skipped probably a few months of stretch lab, but I wanted to kind of show you what it's all about. Um, again, stretching and just really focusing on self care is important, especially if you're constantly going to the gym, it's easy to run your body to the ground. And sometimes I think we're a little bit more stubborn than what we mean to be. So highly recommend stretch lab. Um, obviously there's a few locations out here in Arizona. I know it's a chain, so they are all over, but definitely highly recommending going to Stretch Lab if you've never been. It's game changing and I'm gonna show you what it's all about. Okay, so about to make a protein smoothie. We got 50 grams of protein, iso pure greens for the micros, and I'm gonna add a whole banana. Serious question though, how do you guys open your bananas? From the bottom, stem, or look at that. Oh. What? <laughs> Try it, serious. If you do it, tag me. Boom. It's the best way to open up a banana. This is cute. This is cute. Actually, wait, where's Chase's smoothie? Chase, where's your smoothie at, bro? Look, this is Chase's smoothie. You want to make gains, bro? This is what you got to do right <laughs> here. My cows are so Come small. On. <laughs> so and much. if you don't drink it through a Pikachu straw, you're wrong. Okay, Chase, got There we go. And... <laughs> so this is like 6 p.m. We usually eat dinner about, what, like 8-ish? But I was hungry, so flex chips. Got a serving of those, the best protein chips ever. And then when Chase was gone working out, I had a little Rice Krispie treat. Count Chocula. Yes. <laughs> so, here we are, back at home. Eat Just chilling. We wanted to talk to you briefly about something that we're really fucking excited about, and that is a BA B retreat. BA athlete retreat. This yes. is the first ever BA athlete retreat. We've had so many of our clients and athletes been requesting for this to happen. We tried to do it the year of the COVID, but... COVID. With traveling and everything, we just didn't want people to have to worry or like risk getting COVID. Like I would hate to know that that was the cause, like we caused yeah. that. So, so we decided to postpone it. Um, we, it's been in the works for the last several months and uh, we just released uh, this week that we are hosting it March 11th through the 14th here in Scottsdale, Arizona. We rented out a huge ass mansion with a pool. Yeah. Lots of space to do lots of activities. Hey Athena, wanna you wanna come to the retreat? Yeah. Let's go, come on, get up here. <laughs> So we're having uh, a lot of our clients come into town uh, that Friday, March 11th, uh, just get settled in uh, Arizona. And then that next day, we're gonna be doing a posing seminar, training seminar, just a prep seminar in general. We're doing a lot of giveaways. We've got a lot, of, a lot of sponsored um, companies that are gonna be giving away so many things, um, you know, pre-workout, uh, 
house. Posey, we have packages. Terp, CBD. We have lots of goodies. That make delicious cookies. <laughs> yeah, and then um, aside from that, we're going to be doing team hikes. Uh, we are going to be doing a pool slash rave uh, that we're super excited about because a lot of people join BA uh, because they want to get in the rave scene. So we're going to have <laughs> our own little rave at the pool yeah. with our good friends Mamba and Turbo. Uh, they're going to be DJing and throwing down. They uh, they threw down at our wedding. They're absolutely amazing. So we're super excited about that. Um, what else we got going on? We're going to be doing a big dinner, of course. Yeah. A lot of little dinner. miscellaneous activities uh, to have some of the BA fam in town for. So uh, we've already got some of our clients coming from out of the country uh, so we're super excited about that and yeah. Um, yeah if you guys are interested in it link for that will be down below and spots Tick are limited tickets we're are, are limited. 15 people so we, we most likely will will sell out um pretty quick but uh yeah we'll see how it goes but we're super excited about it and we hope to see you guys in March. and have all the coaches and everybody there yeah, too it's gonna be, be cool fun. all the coaches yeah. are gonna be here just gonna have a lot of athletes and uh, a lot of lifestyle clients here as well and it's just gonna be an amazing team bonding experience and we're gonna make epic shirts and I don't know if we're gonna do shirts, tanks, or, or it's open to everybody, right? Yeah, oh, anybody. Yeah. And you don't have to be on BA, but no. you get to experience. But I bet you want to be on BA afterwards. So. <laughs> but it's open to anybody. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anybody's more than happy to to come. Um, it's gonna be a kick-ass time. So hope to see you there. And that's what we got, right? Yeah. Hell yeah. Let's go. <laughs> these ones. If you haven't tried these, get them. And then what's with these over here? All right. So these are. Um, cauliflower breaded chicken tenders. I've been eating these like every single night and I'll put them in a wrap to make kind of like a healthy crunch wrap for McDonald's <laughs> and sweet potato fries. All right, dinner time. Cooking up some ground turkey with some jasmine rice. And then we got a plate full of health, asparagus, all the carrots. And then I'm gonna make a big ass yogurt bowl with cereal and a fuck ton of honey. Go figure. Yo, brand new cereal, 10 out of 10. Cinegram Toast Crunch. Oh my God. It's so good. Ready for this pour? Yep. There it is. Oof. Gang season. Oof. So I mix this Greek yogurt bowl and then I freeze it for like 10 minutes. What? <coughs> yeah. All right, here we are. Dinner time. Yes. What do we got, babe? All right, so finishing off the day. Usually my dinner's a little bit bigger. I don't mean to macro hoard, but I kind of just don't track enough throughout the Slacking. day. I do. She's not serious, serious about the Don't days. macro hoard. Don't do what I do. But I'm not prepping right now, so it's okay. Is it okay? To me, it's okay. Don't tell yourself it's okay. It's not okay, fam, all right? Listen don't to macro the dietitian. Hoard. Don't macro hoard. All well, right. I kind of accidentally did, sorry. But we got 100 grams of asparagus, um, a high fiber <clears throat> tortilla wrap with those cauliflower chicken tenders and a laughing cow, sweet potato tots, and a serving of that new cinnamon, what is it? What is it? What is it? Cinnamon gram. Cinnamon gram. Freaking bomb cereal. A diet. And then I always like to have a little snack, just like when I'm laying in bed when we watch movies, so I won't film it, but a mini Fit Crunch Bar. Yes, let's go. And uh, yeah, as I already told you guys, we got a bowl of ground turkey, a lot of jasmine rice with salt and honey, asparagus and carrots for the health, my, you know, ice cream for the night, the Greek yogurt bowl with a lot of blackberries and the same cereal, um, and then a cup full of aspartame. Don't you love that sound? <laughs> Mm. God damn. But I typically eat a big ass bowl of uh, spinach and a salad for the night. But again, we didn't go to the grocery store before this. So tonight it's carrots and asparagus. It still looks good. So Cheap we carrots. will flash the total macros <clears throat> for my day of eating right here. Should be about like 300 protein, 425 carb, 40 ish fat, something like that. And then mine will be right here. It might be a little under what I said, because like right, I said, right, I didn't right, right. hit my macros. <laughs> they better not be under. <laughs> okay, I'll use, I'm eating some uh, rice cakes, so I'll put those in there too. I'll hit it. <laughs> but it's right here. <laughs> yep, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that full day of eating. I'm sure we got a lot more in store. Uh, the next full day of eating for me will probably be in prep mode, so Woo! it'll be cool to see the differences there. But uh, yeah. yeah. I'm excited. Talk to you in the next clip. Night. So Chase just left. Lauren is in bed. Your boy's still hungry. So perks of being in the improvement season, 
I'm still gonna eat. So here we are in the pantry. I think I'm gonna go ahead and have another serving or two of some honey nut checks. Or I might do a combo. Yeah, I'll probably mix the two. And then also, I forgot we had these, the new Eggo Pop-Tarts. So I'm gonna have one of those as a nightcap. No flesh the new macros, somewhere on the screen now, probably around 500 carbs. Yo, I'm back. These things fucking slap. Not the greatest Pop-Tart. I'd say like eight and a half out of 10, but definitely the perfect nightcap. All right, now we're going to bed. Okay, it is a good day. One, my voice is finally coming back. Not for long. Not for long, because tomorrow <laughs> is Subtronics, and you know we're going to be raging our faces off all night long. But the lovely wife is going to do my Botox. So Yay. we're going to get some Brotox up in this forehead. If you can see all these lines, we're going to get rid of them, right? <laughs> we're going to make sure you're frozen. <laughs> Freeze and dose me up, Buff Beauty. <laughs> Let's go. You ready for me? <laughs> oh boy. Let's go. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Ooh, half natty lighting. Oh, look at that dough pop. Ooh, ooh, look at all those blinds. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, wow. What'd you think? We're done already. It wasn't bad, it's right? Too easy. I honestly almost fell asleep. Those those little wrinkles right there, they're gonna go away in two weeks. Two weeks? <laughs> two weeks. For full results. For full results. <laughs> I already feel like kicking in right now. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Am I pretty yet? You're always pretty. Oh, thanks, babe. <laughs> so proud of you. Lollipop. Can I have a lollipop? Yes. Don't tease me. <laughs> you can get a lollipop. <laughs> He did so good. <laughs> I'm giving my lollipop. <laughs> That's not something to get gas. You don't want to get gas for that. All right. There we go, just a little plug. <laughs> Perfect for rage. Get you going. Exactly. <laughs> Shameless plug. Oh, so Code Mary. Ready, ready? Oh, you know. Ready. All right. What's up, man? What's up, Peter? Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. How'd it go? Hello. 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 You're an hour late. So what's up? We are getting ready to go to Subtronics, and we have the lovely Liana, one of my BA coaches and IFB bikini pros and best friends <laughs> in the world. And she has to weigh out her banana, but first, how are we gonna open it? The BA way. The BA way. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Fucking mind blowing. Look at that shit. Late. What is you? Late, late, yeah, late. It might be late. But like. <laughs> 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 It's Sunday. Sunday fun day. It's already been a fun day. Yeah. And guess what? We totally forgot to bring our camera to uh, <laughs> our little brunch event that we had going on. 
Lauren was just like, you know, we need to start bringing the camera. Remember to bring our camera everywhere we go. We're vloggers we're now. We're vloggers now. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? You're right. Uh, so we're getting better at this game um, of YouTube. But um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the full day of eating. Uh, that was really cool to have Chase along here just kind of, you know, filming uh, what we eat in a typical day. And, uh, you know, the upcoming videos for me are going to be in prep mode. So it'll be cool just for you guys to see the transition of what I eat during prep. And follow along that. Going after that pro car. Yeah, we'll see, we'll see. So it'll be cool to you know document that along the way. But the previous clips, as you saw, we uh, went to Subtronics over the weekend. Lost my voice yet again, yay. I'm strong, I'm going strong. strong. Yeah, she, she's my voice. Um, it was so much fun though. <clears throat> it was a great time. Really good job putting that on. Subtronics is truly the best fucking DJ. Best DJ. <laughs> Best everything. Like, oh my God, he blows, blows my mind. Uh, we were just talking about how we got some footage at the show and what I thought was really good footage. I was uploading it to the computer and half the clips were blurry as fuck. <laughs> so Yeah, they weren't as good as we thought. <laughs> yeah, in the moment they looked really crisp clear. I, I, I thought so. We never brought in a camera yeah. to, to a rave either. We usually always have our phones and everything. So it was one more thing to think about, but it'll work. <laughs> no, no, absolutely. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this second YouTube video. Um, what we got going on this week? We have some friends coming into town. So there'll be some probably good videos coming up here soon. But uh, yeah. no, we're going to... Do our team call tonight and yep, gonna catch up on sleep. <laughs> monthly team meeting going down in like 30 minutes. So, uh, yeah, we definitely need to catch up on sleep, or I do. Uh, the other night, I went to bed at 6.30 in the morning. Yay. Pulling all-nighters. Who needs sleep? Not us. <laughs> We're thriving off of, I don't know what. <laughs> off of each other's energy. Yes. So we do. Absolutely. But, uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and wrap this video up, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Later.